Hello. Good evening, uh, good everybody. Morning, good evening for the rest of the class. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Brandy. How are you guys? When I was I'm very well. What about you? I'm pretty good. Thank you. Good to see you guys. How was your How was your day today? Well, for me, it's more because I don't have a job, so I have to stay here at home. It was oh. raining all yeah in the morning, so it's kind of boring. Yeah, I I get it. I get it. It's 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 no fun. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's it, it's nice to have day offs and everything when the weather is nice and you can go places, but when the weather is so horrible and you have nowhere to go, that's that's that really sucks. Yeah, but what can you do? Just uh, catch up on your on your series on all of your netflix series <laughs> yeah that's right that's all you can do really uh, dramas. Um, yeah oh okay you, you're into dramas yeah mm, interesting <laughs> okay okay cool is there any any drama that you um that you suggest um oof, there are a lot of I can send you a link because I've been watching some videos because I have nothing to do during the day. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah. That's great. Excellent. Okay. Well, so guys, um, do we have any plans for tomorrow? I know that there's probably not too much you can do, but do you have any plans? Rest. Rest. Yeah, pretty much just stay rest. At home. Huh? Stay at home. Stay at stay home. Up. That's that. Yeah, that's good. Stay at home is 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 a is a very valid uh, option. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. All right, guys and girls. So what we're gonna do today to begin with? Let me take attendance. Um. Okay, starting with Andrea Geraldine Sanchez Recinos. Present teacher. Thank you. Um, and Angel Antonio Ramirez Rodriguez. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Uh, Brandy Marilu Pimentel. Okay, thank you. Present. Um, could you tell me what is that last name? I want to be able to pronounce it. Uh, it's like uh, the bird crawl, 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 just crawl. Check. Oh, crawl check. Crawl check. Oh, okay. That's not too too difficult. Crawl check. Crawl check. Crawl, 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 crawl check. Crawl yeah. check. Okay, that's crawl right. check. Okay. All right. Now, now I got it. Thanks. Okay, um, Edgar Abel Tejada Benitez. I'm here, Miss Guerrero. Wonderful, thank you. Um, oh. It's on Sunny Hernandez Alvarenga. Mm -mm. It's on Sunny Hernandez Alvarenga. Okay, Eduardo Jose Melgar. Melgar? I'm here. All right, wonderful. Okay. Um, Ileana Janet Alvare, Alvar, pero Alvarado Molina. Ileana Janet Alvarado Molina. Irma Raquel Garcia de Monterrosa. I'm here, teacher. Okay, wonderful. Is it possible to open up your uh, camera to for the attendance? In this moment, in my baby's bra fending. Uh, sorry, I, I couldn't hear you very well. In this moment, what? My baby is breastfeeding. Breastfeeding. 
Yes. Oh, okay. I understand. Uh, we just need uh, just your your face, not nothing else. Just your face. Okay. Okay. Okay, wonderful, thank you. All right, um, Jaime Roberto Aldana Bel Beltran. Jaime Roberto Aldana Beltran. Okay. Um, by the way, um, Irma, if uh, we just needed for for the um, for the attendance your 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 face, but if you if you feel more comfortable right now, turning the camera off, you know, for privacy, that's okay. We just we just needed for the attendance, okay? So that's okay. Uh, Joanna Jesenia Garcia de Hernandez. I'm here, teacher. Wonderful. Thank you. Uh, Karen Elizabeth Bernal de Avelar. Present, teacher. Wonderful. Marina Stephanie Arevalo Sanchez. Marina Stephanie Arevalo Sanchez. Nidia Esmeralda Marroquín Guevara. Present, teacher. Wonderful. Thank you. Reina Elizabeth Guerrero Gaitan. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you. Roberto Eduardo Escamilla Gar Garcia. Uh, present teacher. Wonderful. Um, great, great. Okay. Uh, Saul Antonio Hernandez Torres. Saul Antonio Hernandez Torres. Susana Beatriz Abrego Blanco. Susana Beatriz. Vanessa Esmeralda Miranda Alfaro. Present. How are you? Uh, sorry, I can't see you. Susana, uh, ah, hold on, but okay. So Vanessa? Susana, it's here. Say yes. I'm here. <laughs> on oh. chat. Good evening, Miss. Okay. But we okay, can ho see. Ho hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait. Before anything. So uno a la vez. Uh, hold on. Um, so, so okay, Vanessa Esmeralda Miranda. Creo que la escuché, pero no la vi. Eh, Susana Beatriz Abrego. The camera is is, is oh, no okay. One. Okay, okay, I gotcha, gotcha, perfect, excellent, thank you. Y also Susana, Susana Beatriz. Eh, are you here, Susana? We need to hear you say and that you're here. Just the text is on chat. Yeah. Okay, so the thing is that, okay, okay, so the thing is that we need to actually hear your voice and see your face because the the videos are audited by Insaforp. And so the idea with this is that you guys, uh, that Insaforp sees that you are here and they cannot read the the chats like they the chats don't come with the video i'm sorry i'm here but i cannot show my okay. Uh, camera okay moment, so. perfect all right well at least we can hear your your voice yeah so that right. way we can have yeah that that's the idea that we need to show in the video that you actually are here okay right, thank, thank you, you. Right. thank you susana and jancy andrea melendez Press. okay Press. Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Yeah. So just, just to let you guys know that, um, that the reason why we ask for your, for you to open your microphone and say present or, or I'm here or, you know, whatever it is 
show and your in your camera on is because Instaform audits the video. So they see the video and they check that the students are actually in the class. Um, and they cannot see the chats. So um, you know, if you if you just say, if you, you write in the chat, I'm here, we can't really prove anything to Insafort that you actually are here. So that, that's just just let, letting you know, okay? Okay, um, Edson, you have a good comment? Good yes. evening. Good evening. Yes, good evening. Uh, sorry, until now, um, Connect, uh, oh. can you please write me down? Thank you. Okay, thank you, Edson. Thank you. All right, yes. perfect. Okay, guys, we're going to start with our class. Um, please tell me if uh, you are able to see the screen. Yes, teach. Yeah. Wonderful. Okay. So this is what we um, saw yesterday, which are time clauses, right? We talked about time clauses being a part of a sentence that shows when the main action happened, right? So we talked about that, for example, the main action, the main idea is this, I was really immature. And so what the time clause does, which is this part here, it tells us when, in what moment, this activity, this, this action or this idea happened. So when were you immature? Before I had my first job, that's when. So it gives us a time frame as to when the the main idea happened okay so just to review quickly uh the words that the, the connectors or what we call subordinators that tell us um a the So the subordinators that tell us um, when something happens is where it's like before, after, once, the moment, as soon as, until, and by the time. Do you understand these subordinators or do you have any questions about them? What, they're, what they mean? What means the last one? By the time? By the time. That's a good question. Okay. So by the time means no later than. Okay. By the time is like, by the time I graduated. So it means I, in that moment that I graduated, no later, not, not after I graduated. It means right in that moment. It could have been, it, it could have been a little bit before, but definitely not after. It's it's like immediately that, for example, graduate. Uh no, not not immediately. It means before, before. So by the time it's like saying, it's like when you say in Spanish para cuando. Okay, so, para cuando me, me gradué de la secundaria, right? It means that it means that it happened before, but not after. Eh? Para cuando ya, para cuando me gradué de la secundaria, yo ya había empezado a trabajar. So, we're not saying exactly when it happened, we just know that it was before, right? Before you graduated from high school, you started working. Maybe you started working, you know, one year before, six months before, or even one day before, but it happened before. That's the important part. Does that make sense? Um, 
kaya nga first country chef. Yeah. Um, I had a job. Eh, kaya kaya kung kung ons. Once. What what is the word what is the word once in Spanish? You you know this word because eh, we like for example once twice. So for example, once a week. Once upon a time. <laughs> Mm -hmm. yeah so do you, does that does that make sense like once to like once twice like once a week i i go to to work five uh five times a week but i go to the gym once a week for example so what is once in spanish Una vez. Una vez. Una vez. Una vez. Una vez. exactly so it's the same idea so, una vez, in this case, una vez que obtuve uh, un trabajo. Okay. Does that, make, does that make sense? It's clear? Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. In this case, yeah. it sounds better like En cuanto haya terminado de, no, en cuanto haya tenido un trabajo. No. Right? No, 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 no. Once. Un, no, no. Once is una vez. Un, okay. Por ejemplo, una vez. Eh, uh, una vez. Obtuve, eh, por eso. Sorry. Una vez obtuve. No, 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 está, es que está, no, no piensen de una vez de que una, una vez, sino que es como, es, eh, acuérdense que, que hay palabras que tienen diferente significado, por ejemplo, una vez que, um, una vez que hayas ter, eh, terminado tu trabajo, me llamas, right, so, it means it means in the moment, immediately after, right? Yeah, even in Spanish, that's what it means. Una, uh, una vez que hayas, eh, o oh, una vez que, um, mm -hmm. uh, Sí, o sea, pa, uh, por ejemplo, una vez que hayas terminado tu trabajo, me llamas para que te vaya a recoger. Right? So it means like immediately after. The same thing in, 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 in English. Once I had a job, it means immediately, immediately after I had a job, I became totally independent. All right? Does that make sense? All right. Yes. Yes. Yeah. All right. Teacher, mm -hmm. for example, in the until I graduate, ya graduado. Until until, until, until I graduate. Means hasta. Hasta ya graduado. Pero until I graduate. Yeah, so it means like it would be like hasta que me gradué. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, any other questions, guys? Go ahead and ask. No, teacher, it's okay. Questions, questions, preguntas. It's okay. clear for me, teacher. Okay. All right. All right. In that case, um, what we're going to do now that we understand that, um, we're going to do this part right here. So, what do you think about these events? Write sentences using time clauses in the present. Okay, so 
What do you think of these events? You get your driver's license. You go out on your first date. You get your first job. You get a credit card. You buy your first bike, mo uh, moped, or car. You have your own bank account. You get married. You become a parent. Do we understand this vocabulary? Um, what is moped? Uh, a moped is like um like similar to a motorcycle, but it's like um. You know, you know those motorcycles that they use, like for example, in that are very typical in uh, in Europe, like in um, Italy. Have you seen those like motorcycles? Those like kind of like scooters. They look like scooters. Como eléctricas. Como scooters eléctricas. Yeah. Yeah, it could be, but it's like a, it's like a regular scooter. Yeah, yeah, it's more like a like a like a scooter, let's say. Um, so it's not really a motorbike; it's more like a scooter. Um, does that make sense? So think about, for example, in movies you probably have seen, um, you have seen like movies, uh, sure. of uh huh. Como una vespita, no. Uh -huh. sí. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, um, any other questions? Okay, um, so I want you to, we're going to be talking about these um these events and what i want you to do is to make sentences using the time clauses okay but you're not going to actually write them okay i, I don't want you we're not going to um we're not going to do writing i want you mostly to concentrate on um on speaking okay so i'm going to send you right now um the this um this picture here okay um and i'm also going to be sending you the information of the time clauses so that you can remember which time clauses it's possible to use Okay, please tell me if you receive the two pictures. Yes, it's a WhatsApp group, everyone. Yeah, it's in the, whenever I, I tell you that I send you pictures, it's because it's in the WhatsApp group, okay? So do you guys see it? Yes, chair. Yeah? Okay, all right, so what I want you to do um, is I want you to um, yeah, so I want you to um, talk to your classmates and you're going to be talking about those different um, situations and your opinions, but I want you to use time clauses. Okay, not don't write them, just speaking. Okay. Are the instructions clear for you guys? Will you give us an example, please? Sure. So um so one of them is your to get um you get your driver's license. Okay. So let's talk about getting your driver's license. Um 
So it says, what do you think people learn from these events? Okay, so uh, once you get your driver's license, um, you become more independent because you can go, you can drive anywhere. Okay, that's an example. Or for example, another one could be, um, the moment you get your driver's license, you realize you have a big responsibility. What is it, time cloud? The moment you get your, the moment. So the moment you get your driver's license. Okay. Does that make sense for you? Yes, no. Yeah, everybody is not, don't want to say nothing, but no, I'm not really sure. <laughs> Repeat. Yes. Yeah, I don't understand. Okay, so you in the chat, I sent to you the situations, right? So there are, um, let me see. It's like a, the first one is you get your driver license, but yeah. where, where are we going to put the time closer? It, this is like a, the first part, or this is the second? This is the first part. Okay. Um, like time closer use uh, to, uh, to time for express uh, one uh, opinion of your life. So right? this is what people learn from these life events. Okay, so that's what we're talking about. What people learn. Okay, what do people learn from these from these um life events? And an example is given to you right here. After you get your driver's license, you find out that all your friends want rides. So that's what you learn. That's that's what you learn. Um from the life event of getting your driver's license. What do you learn? You learn that um, so after you get your driver's license, after you drive you get your driver's license, you find out that all your friends want rides okay yeah i have that here now yeah does that make sense now yeah yes okay good so uh remember the, i i sent you the the picture of all the time clauses so you can use different ones whatever you you want to use there is no right or wrong answers as long as you use the time clauses all right do you have questions you want to ask no no okay all right, perfect. In that case, I am going to stop sharing and I'm going to be sending you to breakout rooms. Um, is there anybody that is not going to be participating or something like that? Is everybody here? Nivia? Irma? Roberto? Iliana, Vanessa, Susana. Roberto, Iliana, Vanessa, Susana, are you there? Yes, teacher, I'm here. Yes. Okay. You will be able to participate? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. Okay, so what I will do then is I'm going to 
Create breakout rooms. Um, just a moment. Okay, um, so I think everybody should have a partner. If anybody, for whatever reason, ends up without a partner, then please let me know. There is a there's a button when you guys go into the breakout rooms, there's a button that says ask for help. So don't hesitate to push that button if you end up without a um a a partner because that way I can help you. I can I can take you to another group or you know that anything like that. Okay. So here we go. Let's open the rooms. Oh, sorry, second. Okay, here we go. So, Joanna, you have any problems getting in? To go out your, uh, on your first date, but you realize that you don't have money. <laughs> uh, Sometimes. <laughs> Which one do you like? Uh, yo había escrito que cuando tienes tu primera cita te vistes elegante. No sé si da. Sí. That's amazing. You dress very elegant. Okay. You are wearing the best dress you have, right? <laughs> yes. So, very good, best. Reina. Just that we need to talk in English. Okay. So, can you say that in English? I'm sorry. Okay, so the idea is good, but we need to uh -huh. say that idea in English. Okay, in English. Mm -hmm. Can you say that in English? Okay, say. Um, is to go out in your first day, and you dress very elegant. Is correct or not? <laughs> Okay, we need to use the time clause. Mm -hmm. Um, tengo, en español tengo que usar a uh, los las cláusulas de tiempo, verdad? Yeah, what what uh, I sent okay. you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Entonces, mm, okay, just understand. Okay. okay. Um, uh, the moment it is, is the moment to dress very elegant. No, it, it would have to be. No. It would have to be the time clause is 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 the, the situation the event. So the. Mm. So the moment. Mm -hmm. You go on a date on a date, right? Was that? Mm hmm. Okay. So the mm -hmm. moment you go on your first date, blah, 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 blah. First date, uh huh. Uh, completed. You go, you go up and do your first date. The moment 
to dress very elegant. No, 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 no. Okay, so the moment you go on a first date, in el, in el momento que uno va mm -hmm. a una, cita, a una a primera una cita, cita. Mm -hmm. so that's what that's the idea. So the 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 main clause is dressing elegantly. That's the main clause. Ah, oh, okay. You have to use that time clause at the beginning. All right? Not necessarily. You can no. put it at the end. You can say, right. for example, it is possible to say mm -hmm. you dress very elegantly the moment you go on your first date. That's possible. But the the time clause has to be with that life event. Okay. Okay. We were thinking uh, in using before you go out on your first day, you are dressing elegant. You dress elegant. Okay. You you dress okay. Yeah. And the next example will be uh, number three to get your first job. Um, at the moment, I feel happy because I will contribute to my home, for example. Okay. Sounds, sounds good. Or we can add as well, as soon as you, as your, as, no, as soon as you get your first job, you start being in the independent as well right yeah this is a good example mm -hmm. okay let, let's use assume Number four. To get a credit card. Mm -hmm. Once you get a credit card. My friend pay. Okay, first date, sorry. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, once you you got your first date. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Let me. Why? What do you want to say? My first date. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I had my first date. I remember I was like. Uh, excited because that was something new for me <laughs> and maybe uh yes that that uh, experience was was exciting uh, yes i think okay. that's it <laughs> so so the idea is to use time clauses what do you learn okay. what do you learn from it what do people learn from it uh, before, after, blah, 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 and, and say what you learn from it. Um, okay. okay. Yes, thank you. Okay, once I, ha I have my first uh, date, I learn um, sorry, <laughs> Let me let me think. Uh, 
So I, don't know, I think how to I learned how to speak with uh, with people, how to how to create that relationship that you have with you, with your with your partner. I think that was something that I learned uh, at the moment when I had my first my first date. Yeah, exactly. Very yes. good. Okay. Thank yeah, you. that's good. Can you can continue? Um, let me uh, uh, let me think about another topic. For example, my first job. Uh, as soon as I had my first job, I learned um, that all my expectation were not like I like I thought because you, you are like you are like used to to act in some way because you have been studying and but in the in the in the work it is very <laughs> you cannot act like like you were studying or something like this because uh, you your job your first job is is a complete change of of thinking in my case because you you have to help the company and when you are studying uh, people are helping you <laughs> that was something that i learned uh, after i had my my first job Yes. Hey, Vanessa, would you like to? Yeah. How old yes, are you? Yes, I can. Uh, 26. 26. Okay. Yeah. But, you know, it's good uh, if you get your driver license. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, when I am uh, like... Uh, um, driving or um, doing things uh, about, uh, I mean, shopping or when I go to the hospital or even when I go to my mom's work, I always uh, see in the in the app and this is the name is Wait. I always yeah. see in this app if there is you a. Try to avoid the cops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got it. Now uh, that's the reason. When they give me a ticket for uh fifty five something, I say no, nah, no, no. I don't going to give them more money. So yeah, I drive exactly. like, yeah. I um, think sorry, that's girls. The to I, I don't have. Yeah. Oh, sorry, girls. Trying to interrupt I... you. Uh, just just wanted to let you know, girls. Both of you um uh have your name incomplete in the in the um in the platform and i don't want you guys uh, you girls to have any problems with um the attendance so if it's possible maybe you can change your names um so that we can have it complete okay okay teacher i never have problem with this teacher i've been here for five months <laughs> yeah that those are the the instructions though so we're just following the instructions that Insaforp gives us. Simple as that. Okay, so um yeah. Okay, um, so we are going to um bring you back to the main room. Okay, so I'll see you girls in the main room. All right, see you.
Okay. All right, guys and girls. So, um, so we were talking in the groups um, about um, what you think is um, uh, things that people learn in different situations. So let's talk about the first one. Um, the first one we were looking at was um, you get your driver's license. So what lesson do you think people can learn from when you get your, your driver's license? Um, I think you get more responsibility because uh, you're driving when you're driving with your family or your, with your friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like uh, you have okay. to take care of them. Right. Good. Excellent. Could you tell me that idea using a time clause? Um, after get your driving license. Mm -hmm. What? Okay, so after getting your driver's license, what happened? Uh, yeah, I forgot that. Either. Okay, so you, you said, well, after you get your driver's license, uh, you have to. You don't, get don't more have to. Uh, you don't have to drink. For simple. <laughs> you realize that you are the official Uber of the family. No. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. That's fair enough. Yeah. All right. Next one. You go on your first date. What do people learn? What lesson do they learn when you go on your first date? When you get the uh, lice, the tribal license that's what mm -hmm. you're talking about no the no no one, the next yeah the next one after it says you go on your first date what do people learn when they go on their first date uh before you you go on out on your first day you are dressing on very elegant okay <laughs> all right very good all right excellent what else what else do people learn Mm -hmm. For example, uh, before you go out on your first days, mm -hmm. but you, real, you realize that you don't have money. <laughs> okay, so before you go on your first day, you realize you don't have enough money? Yes. Okay. All right, so. After yeah. your first day. Yeah, is it before or after? Uh, before. After. What as soon as the first day finished. Yeah, <laughs> as maybe... soon as the first the yes, first day finished, you you have to see if this is a good person for continuous or you can quit with this. Right. Yeah. Okay. As soon as you as we finish your first day, you gotta figure out if this is a good person to date or not, right? Yeah, very good. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, you get your first job. What do people learn when you get your first job? Me teacher. Yeah. Until I get my first job, I go value the money. Okay, until, I, yeah, good. Until I got my first job, I couldn't value money. Yeah, exactly. So before you get your first job, sometimes you think that money grows on trees. <laughs> your your parents just make money, like growing money on trees. What else? Anything else? Until you get your first job, you have to figure out how to take care, how to be in role of your job and try to grow up in the company. Okay, yes. All right, except when you, in that sense, uh, the verb would just be grow. 
grow in the company because grow up means literally to mature and into a better person or a bigger person. Mm -hmm. So in that case, just grow. Okay, very good. Uh huh. What else? Anybody else can tell me? Uh, teacher, another one can be once you get your first job, mm -hmm. your first your first job, uh, you can start to save money. Yeah. Save yeah, exactly. money. Yeah, that would be ideal. Although most people don't. <laughs> most people start spending money like crazy when they get the first job, right? Okay, good. You get your credit, you a credit card. What do you learn? <laughs> yeah, I was talking with somebody about this credit card because it's like when you get your first credit card, it's like you get crazy and you want to spend and spend the money like you're going to leave tomorrow. <laughs> yeah so and at the end everybody say no the credit card are bad oh no the credit they stole your money but it's not it's not right because if you know that you spend ten dollars at the end of the month you have to pay this ten dollar if right. you spend yeah if you spend more money that, that you earn how are you going to pay your credit card exactly it's not right exactly Okay. Any other lessons? Uh, once you get your credit card, you can buy your own home. Your own what? You can buy your own home. Home? Not really. With a credit I'm card. I'm, I'm talking. <laughs> I'm talking about a bit a big credit credit. <laughs> a platinum credit card. <laughs> wow, I but I don't know if you can get a, a, a that kind of credit card on your first your yeah. first credit card. <laughs> that, that's your, yeah, <laughs> it's gonna be difficult unless you are like like. Uh, so you maybe... put your feet on your on the air. <laughs> <laughs> unless you are like the heir to a th to the throne or something like that. But other than that, uh, you're probably not gonna get that as your first credit card wow. <laughs> the beginning is a little money that the we can have in a credit card mm -hmm. yeah, yeah normally they give they start you with a small amount yeah, right exactly. yeah yeah exactly but but what you what you can do is the moment you get your first credit card you can start making um or, or better said, um, creating a credit record so you can buy your new a new house, okay. right? Yeah, that you can do, right? So because in order to buy a house, you need to have um, your your uh, a record, right? You have to have your uh, financial Good. record. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Good uh you buy your first bike moped or car what do you learn until you buy your first car mm -hmm. you stop the public transportation <laughs> yes definitely no doubt about that Okay, good. Anything else? Mm, for example, uh, once you buy your first car, you figure it out the, how necessary it is learn mechanic, basic mechanic. Okay. Yeah, very good. Absolutely, I agree. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay, uh, because of time, we're going to continue with the next one. You have your own bank account. What do you learn when you have your own your own bank account?
Right. The moment you have your own bank account, you start to save money. Okay. All right. Very good. Anything else? Me, teacher. Mm -hmm. When I have my old bank account, I learn and save money. Okay. Okay, very good. When I got I got my my bank account, I learned to save money. Very good. All right, excellent. Next one. Uh, you get married. I can see your faces already. <laughs> okay, uh-huh. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Uh, me um, once you get married, you learn to be responsible with expense. With expenses, yes. Expenses. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Yeah. What else? Uh, me, teacher. <laughs> yes. Yes, I'm here. By the time uh, when you get married, maybe you learn uh, to be a patient person, more patient person. Yes. Yes, very good. You hope. By the least. time you get married, like you lose your freedom. <laughs> there is no more freedom. <laughs> well, it's, I, I mean, it's not that it's not, you don't have freedom. It's just that it's, it's different. It's different. Yeah. Freedom. Freedom yeah. is freedom. <laughs> <laughs> no. I mean. It depends, okay. It's just, it's just an example, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Anything else? Don't don't scare people away from marriage, Brendy. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, once uh, you get married, ah, oh, your life is like a uh, pink, like so... like a heaven. <laughs> yeah, it's like a heaven. It's yeah, heaven, that's yeah. right. Uh -huh, uh, yes. Don't worry, everything will be okay. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, last one. You become a parent. Um, me teacher. Yes. Until you become parents, to understand your parents. Ah, yes. Until you become a parent, you understand your own parents. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Absolutely. That's very true. Anything else? No. No? Okay. All right, guys and girls. Uh, so we're going to stop there because uh, our time's up so um tomorrow no class okay uh, uh, yeah. so have fun in your home <laughs> watching netflix <laughs> okay and uh hopefully uh by you know by friday things will get better and uh and by the weekend, maybe you'll be able to go out and have fun. But for the time being, be careful, please. Um, you know, be very, very careful because things are not easy, even if, you know, it's been raining quite a lot, I know. And so it, the, the ground, the soil is very, is, uh, <clears throat> is very um, uh, sludgy and, um, you know, anything can happen. So be very careful. So I will see you Friday. Okay. So don't forget to connect Friday. Okay. If not, I'll send you guys a little message. All right. So take have care and have a good night as well. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Teacher. Bye. 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 Bye.